Got him. Good one. Oh, yeah. Small moment. Oh, yeah. Oh, right. good small moment, bud. Look at that, bud. Very nice. Hey. Very nice. That's yeah. a great way to start a day. Man. Yes, sir. <laughs> Oh, Very good nice. fish, That's man. Fish. Yeah, baby. Just the top of the mouth there, buddy. <laughs> nice one. Right on. Look Very at how nice. healthy that fish is. It's great. Tell you what, welcome to the show, folks. I'm Ron James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. And we are at Grand Tapatoo Resort in Perry Sound. The fall colors are here, man. I love it, man. Great. And it, it feels like summer, though. <laughs> it is 24 degrees yeah. in mid-October, and we yeah. got a warm front, so yeah. hopefully that'll turn these babies on. That's great. You it's know incredible. what, you gotta stick around and watch this one. This place is absolutely gorgeous for families. It's got everything you want from winter to summer. Stick around, we'll tell you all about it. All right, let's catch some more. All right, man. <laughs> Get him, bud. Get him. You are watching Fish TV. Brought to you by Rapala, crafted from experience. Budweiser Prohibition Brew. All Budweiser. No alcohol. Go RVing Canada. Bring back wildhood. And Cabela's, world's foremost outfitter. With your hosts, Leo Stockos, Ron James, and Jeff Chisholm. It's a five pounder. This structure here is unbelievable. Yep. Trees, docks, and the water. There's seven and a half feet of water here, man. It's a great looking spot. It is. Great looking lake. I love coming to a new lake. And the resort we're staying at is unbelievable. Hit it. Got him. Got him. <laughs> yeah. You see the what you do? Stop there? Yep. You yeah. did not. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. I seen you reeling, and then what'd you go? Well, hit he it? came like... up. He came up and missed it, and then he went. Uh, he was sitting right there, and I didn't want to bring it any closer to the boat because I figured I'd spook him, right? Oh, okay. So I just paused it. <laughs> nice. And then twitched it again. Bam! He hit it. <laughs> he rocked it. Oh yeah. Nice one, bud. There That's we... pretty cool. There we go. Ate that spinner bait. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Hit it! Oh, that's all I heard was, hit it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. He missed it the first time. Well, he did Dang. swipe at it. Well, he came up and flared his gills, but he didn't suck it in. Oh. Yeah. Well, bigger than the last one. We'll just keep upgrading here as the day goes. That's right, buddy. <laughs> what we found is these weeds. Yes. The lily pads, the only weeds yeah. in the lake. You come along the edge and it drops right off. And that's where these pikes seem to be sitting, just right on the edge of the weeds there. Seems to be a pattern. I think we'll get some bigger ones. We know they're here because our buddy Nick Antropoff was here last week and he sent me a picture. Have a look at it. He's not a little guy. Oh, <laughs> that's no. a big fish. Yeah, he, he, I think that fish was like 25, 30 pounds. I mean, it was a giant. Yeah. It's now time for the Fish TV Tackle Box. Hey guys, we're going to take a minute out of the action and show you exactly what we're using here today. When you come to Grand Tapatou Resort in the fall, you wanna make sure you bring yourself some of these. This is the Terminator Spinner Bait. The flash and vibration of this bait is gonna draw those fish out of the vegetation and trees, and you'll catch them just like we did today. We're fishing these baits on Suffix 832 braided line, 40 pound, on the Rapala Concept Rod and Reel. When you come to Grand Tapatou Resort in the fall, you wanna make sure you bring all this gear with you. Now let's get back to that fish TV action. Oh, there's one. Pike, pike, big pike, giant pike. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> Look at this, this massive. is crazy, man. Look at that. <laughs> I love this place. Oh, look at that. What province are we in again? <laughs> <laughs> like seriously. Look at the length of that thing. Oh, oh he just come unbuttoned. Oh. That was a cow. That was a beast. Over 40, like, I don't know, <laughs> but. <laughs> wow, that was a giant, man. I know. Holy. Heartbreaker. I hope we, hope we get a couple of those. Oh. It, it seems to be the pattern, yeah. I think. I don't know. Like, yeah. We've seen another big fish. What it is is there's a drop off that comes down here and there's just isolated pads. There's no weeds. Yep. yep. And you think they're just sitting in there? I think. That. I think so. I think as you're approaching bays, maybe in the bays, yep. 
maybe on the edges of them. But these bays, this is not just a typical bay, it's like 20, 30 feet in the middle. Yeah, exactly. So I think what's happening is, is they're, they're coming in here to feed, put the feed bag on. Yeah. That was a giant, I hope we get a couple of those because I think, I think we're on something. I, I really do. And I got a feeling in the fall uh, Terminator spinnerbait pattern yeah. might be the... Well, they're looking for something, <laughs> you know, bulky. Yeah, yeah. Well, Ron, I have no idea how I lost that fish. <laughs> he crushed it. Well, I, mean, I don't know if he's fully fish. committing. That's the thing. Okay. I'm going to try the VM VMC Stinger, I think. You know what? That's Put a hook a, a little bit farther idea. back, so if they're not fully committing... Grab me one. <laughs> I'll do the same, right. in case right, I get bit. It. Those Stinger hooks come in really handy. It just slips all over top of your hook and like that. up your odds. Puts a hook a little farther back. When they come and swipe at it, there's a, there's a hook there. Are you getting warm? Is I can't it, breathe. You Undo this thing. I, <laughs> you want to go swimming? <laughs> Undo this thing. I can't breathe. I'm oh. serious. Hurry up. <laughs> you know there the Cabela's go. jackets work. Whoa. <laughs> Still going. <laughs> that scared me. That kind of <laughs> Like my heart? I didn't want it. Because it, it was whistling right by my ear. The nice thing about these, though, is they're light to wear. They don't take up a lot of space. Yeah. And, and this isn't done now. You just put another CO2 canister in. You just let the air out yeah, of it, roll it, roll back, it back up. up, put it back together, throw another CO2 canister in, and back you go again. My heart's still pounding. <laughs> but at least I know if I ever fall in the water, it's going to work. <laughs> I always wondered that. <laughs> I thought a jet was coming down. Oh, that's great. <laughs> All I hear is, I must have hit the thing. So there's a pulley thing here. And as I'm casting, I must have hit it on the way down. And this is the result right there. And I think I got to change my shorts. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> yeah, look at the leaves falling now. It's almost like it's snowing, look at it. <laughs> There's one. Yeah. There we go. Oh, oh largey. Smallmouth. Smallie bite. Oh, it is a smallie, yeah. Nice fish. There we go. Smallmouth. Yeah. Pike. <laughs> Apparently there's some good largies in here too. Whack it hard. Oh, he crushed it. Did he? That's what they do. <laughs> nice. Winter is coming. Yeah. Fall is what? here. The good thing about coming to Grand Tapa too, you got the opportunity to come out fishing but you can bring your family. It's such a beautiful, beautiful place. They got an outdoor sauna, they got an indoor sauna, they got a great beach, they got a workout center. You know, it's fall, but still swimming in the pool inside. Right? Yeah. yeah, yeah, they got an indoor pool. You name it, they got it. And the colors of the trees, beautiful. phenomenal. This whole lake is beautiful. People travel for miles, like fly from Japan just to come and look at the colors of Canada. Sure. Yeah. It's true. Definitely. Is that a bass? I don't know. I think what? it's a bass. It's a bass. Oh, it's largey. a good largey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good largey for sure. Off the tree again, eh? Is there a tree there? Yeah. It came right off that, I think. You hit it on the outside. Look. Oh, look at how healthy these fish are in here, bud. Feeding up for fall. They're healthy. And they got five and six pounders in here. I'd like to hook onto one of those, too. Yeah. Awesome. Okay guys, we're gonna take a break out of that fantastic fishing action right now because the last time we did this, we had such a great response. People were emailing in saying, give us some other recipes that we can do in another 20 minutes. So Chef, you got a couple more for us. I, I got your back, no problem, man. We've got a crispy haddock tostada and tostada is basically Spanish for toasted. And if you look at the base of this right here, it's toasted, it's nice and crispy. And then we've topped it with some guacamole, some shredded lettuce. We've got our crispy haddock on top. A pineapple pico de gallo, which is okay, basically not, a pineapple sauce. Not even showing salsa. off with words, like man. You know what? You're trying to be international <laughs> here. You know what? The, the bottom line is, we got it nice and easy, Beautiful. from frozen to plate in under in 20, 20 minutes. minutes right? We got this. This looks like something you would get in a restaurant. Well, exactly. And some people like to be more creative with their fish, right? So this allows you to do that. It's our wild Pacific salmon. 
You can season it, pop it on the grill, and I've just put it on a base of a strawberry and pecan salad. So it's, it's, it's really simple, maple, lime dressing, dress it up, pop it on, so away you go. Once again, we're talking healthy, we're mm -hmm. talking fast, we're yep. talking quick, and it's something for the whole family to enjoy. I'll tell you what, guys, these are just two of several recipes that are available on the Highliner website. Check it out, but right now, let's get back to that great fish TV action. Cast I stopped reeling really <laughs> for a second. That looks like a good spot right there. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Getting bigger. Awesome. Barely got them hooked because I stopped reeling. There we go. Now we're talking. We're getting bigger, boys. We're getting bigger. They're healthy, though. They're getting on the feed, eh? Pike. Pike. Oh, I thought you had a <laughs> giant large one. Nice fish, though. Yeah. There you go. I thought uh, for a second that I had a good oh. bass. <laughs> I looked away nice. for a second, so I didn't see him. Yeah, he crushed it like he meant business. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think there's some bigger ones in here yet. Portions of Fish TV were brought to you by Mercury. Go boldly. Yeah, this is a better fish. That's all right, man, right, Ron? Yeah. Nice. That's a heavy one, man. <laughs> Just slammed it. That's a good fish right there. A lot of fun, man. Hundred of these. One after another and they just slam it. Terminator spinner baits. There you go. Thank you very much. There's one. Feels like a decent fish, bud. What do you have, Ron? Nice. Ooh, it's a large boat. Look at this. Yeah. Well, they have everything here at Grand <laughs> <Everything>. Tapa, too. <laughs> he hit it hard, too, man. Beautiful. There we go. Look at how fat that is, Jeff. That's just a nice all-around little fish. Nice fish. Nice colors on it too, eh? You come off that tree in there? You come off this bank? I probably, yeah, yeah, that tree right there. Beautiful structure here. Oh, unbelievable. Everywhere you look. These fish like to eat up just before the, the winter time. So give them a good profile bait. Like if you look at Jeff Spinner bait going through the water, it looks big and bulky and it looks like a school of minnows. Once in a while, kind of stop your you retrieve, let it fall a little bit, then reel some more. It's not really hard to fish a spinnerbait. Okay, guys, we're going to sit down and talk to Trevor, the owner of Grand Tapatu. Okay. You bought this when? Five years ago. Okay, so 2014, somewhere in there. Yes. When you bought it, it was kind of... It, it was a little bit run down. It had been closed for a couple of years. It's beautiful now. Thanks. You've done a lot of work here, and it's just gorgeous. You're open all year round, which I like. Yes. Not many resorts are. We have the Skidoo Trail available. The main trail comes right to this resort. So your restaurant's open all year round? 365 days a year. That is amazing. So guys that are out snowmobiling, they can stop in here, have a meal, or even stay a night or two. Absolutely. So you offer that? Yep. Now, uh, other things you do is banquets, right? Mm -hmm. What other things do you do? We do weddings, okay. any function at all. If people need space or rooms, we yep. can take care of it. How many rooms? Uh, we have 22, we have 37 rooms. Okay. Eight cottages and eight suites. Now the cottages, are they like family dwelling cottages or? Yes, they have kitchenettes, fireplaces. They range from one bedroom to three bedroom. The room I'm in is absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. I mean, it's got two king size bed, it's got a fireplace, it's got a balcony. All the rooms overlook the lake, which yes. is just gorgeous. Also, you have free kayaks and canoes. Yes, small motor boats with 9.9 .9 horsepower motors. And you motors. can rent them, right? Those are rental. What a great place for a wedding. We do a lot of weddings. I'll bet you. Yeah, and a lot of outside weddings. People, it's a big thing. Yeah. Yeah, it yeah. really is. And you got a beautiful rock out there to look out over the, yeah. the lake. We, we checked that out. That's pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, it's a nice spot. Water on three sides. It's up high. And beautiful. It's beautiful, yeah. you got a great spot here, buddy, and I appreciate okay. you letting us come here. The fish is pretty good, too. Yeah. I mean, yeah. You, you guys got, did all right. You guys got some giants. You, you got yeah. some giant fish out there. Yeah, we do. I really appreciate it, my friend. Thank you, Ron. You know what? It was a great time. It was a pleasure having you guys here. Thank you. They even give you fruit salad here. Unbelievable. Pike. Yeah, that's not, scar that's not pike. That's not pike, bud. I've seen that pike at the dock, Jeff. Same pike. 
The that. same one. Exactly, because it had the same snout mark on it. Scar on its it face? It came around the corner <laughs> in one morning. That's probably what, a quarter of a mile? They can swim. <laughs> Gotta be the same fish, because it looked identical. It's a fish. Yeah, there you go. Nice oh, it's a giant. It's a, it's just a cow. It is just a cow. <laughs> Look at the size of this thing. <laughs> Holy <laughs> mackerel. You gotta be kidding me. Look at this thing. Oh my goodness. I look down, I go, it's a cow. Oh, bud, look at this thing. Are you kidding me? Oh, man. This is unreal. Huge fish in this lake. Oh man, I hope I get one like this. <laughs> That's a giant bud. Oh, he man. just ate it too. Come on, bring him in here. Oh, oh my goodness, I can't get him in. <laughs> Look at this thing. Oh <laughs> my <laughs> goodness. <laughs> oh. Oh. That is Holy, a, that's the biggest plank I've ever seen, that dude. That is huge. That's a, I've never seen one that big. This is huge. Oh. <laughs> Look at the size of it. I tell you what, Grand Tapatu is unbelievable. I got I hope I get one like that. Yeah. I've seen two of them swim by. Not quite as big as that, but that is one giant. I'm shaking as much as you are, and I didn't catch it. <laughs> Oh, look at the head on it. That right there. Oh, that's a giant. That's a trophy pike right there. <laughs> you can go, you can go anywhere, anywhere in Canada. Anywhere. <laughs> for a trophy pike. That, that is a head. giant. Look at the shovel Beautiful. head on that thing. Man. He's a monster, dude. He's a monster. Like, you would have to fly to Saskatchewan. Yeah. Or, no. You know, for... We just got to come to Van <laughs> yeah, to Perry Sound. It's a couple hours from the GTA. That is a giant dude. Yeah. <laughs> that, that is a tank. A huge bike. I can't believe the size of it. No, neither can I. Unbelievable. Just take your time. Give a good grip of the tail. And she'll let you know when it's time to go. She'll give a good kick. But just take your time. Her gills are moving, her fins are moving. She's a beauty, bud. There, she just gave me a little bit. He, she's getting ready to go now. Yeah, look at her. There she goes. There she goes. There. There she goes. All right. Look at that. <laughs> what a fish, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> what a day. Awesome. Man. Oh, what a place. I think you're next, man. Oh, I hope You got to so. get one of these right now. I've seen two of them chase my bait. And they've been, yeah. I don't think they were quite like that, but I mean, <laughs> they're good fish, you know what I mean? And yeah. He just didn't hook up, but what a hook up that was. All right, let's do it again. Good job, man. <laughs> Unbelievable. Holy. I got a fish. Good one, too. Big pike. Nice. Big northern. We're good fish. <laughs> Look at this tank, bud. Oh. oh, yeah, this is a good fish, dude. Nice. Oh, That's a good one, man. Oh, <laughs> Look at the size oh, of that. Oh, it's going down. It's going downtown. All right, let's make some room on the deck for this guy. <laughs> We're going to need the net. I don't think so, man. Yeah. No, he he's, fit in the no net. he's not going to fit in the net. Look at this. Oh, look at, look at, look, look, look. <laughs> oh, he's a tanker. Man. He might go in the net. He, he, no, he, I think I'm going to. Bud, don't miss this fish. <laughs> i got to get a picture of this. Look at, he, he's been hooked or something. He's got a snout problem. Look at the width of him. He won't fit in the net, man. Look at, the, look at him. Oh. Bring him to me and I'll get him for you. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you what. Grand Tapatu, baby. What a place. What a place is right. <laughs> Look at the size of this thing. Look at the width of it. Okay, get him, Jeffrey. Get him, Jeffrey. Oh, he's not ready. He's not ready. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him screaming out the drag. You've got him hooked. Yeah, I got him pretty hooked, pretty good, but it's in that hole where he got hooked before. By the looks of him, he looks mean. Oh, that's a good one, man. Oh, what a day. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, he's barely hooked now. Get that net, man. <laughs> you want to try it? Yes. I don't think he's going to fit. No, he's going to. 
Come on, hurry up. He's gonna fit. Get him head first. Get him head first. He'll fit. He'll fit. Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> That's what we're talking about. He's thick. Oh, he's huge, bud. Look at the head on this thing. Look at that. Just barely got him hooked, too. Look at this. That's why you come to Grand Tapa to right there. Look at this thing. What a cow. Yeah. You got my glasses, bud? You bet. They're fogging up. I'm sweating. <laughs> What a day, I'll tell you what. Unbelievable. You have to come to Perry Sound and Grand Tapa too if you want to catch some giants like this. There's smallmouth, big, huge northerns, lakers. Yeah. They got it all right here, man. Great place to stay, great accommodations, great food. What a place. I'm excited now. We got it. We got the one. That's a good way to end the day, man. You know what? Oh, man. <laughs> What do you say we go back to Grand Tapa 2 and get some fantastic dinner? Oh, you betcha. You know what? <laughs> what a place, guys. For sure. Until For next sure. week, I'm Ron James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. We'll see you right here on Fish TV, baby. More of these guys. <laughs> <laughs> Great job. Great job. What a day. <laughs> Beautiful fish, Ron. Oh, man. You're going to go. There he goes. There he goes. Very nice. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, grand tap <laughs> too, baby. Woo. Nice one. <laughs> <clears throat> Fish TV was brought to you by Lund, the ultimate fishing experience.